Hello guys and welcome back to another one of my YouTube videos. If you guys are here right now, you want to learn how to do the glitch effect with Posca paint markers. And I'm going to show you. So as you guys can tell, I have four different markers. I have the white, black, a light blue, and a light red one. First thing I'm going to do is outline the whole image in black. There is a few different sizes with the Posca paint markers. Me personally, for the glitch effect, I like to use the thick one just because it gives me a thicker outline and then I go over each side with the different red and blue colors. Once you are done outlining your image black, grab one of your either red or blue markers and we're gonna start right now. Now that you have the black outline completed, grab your blue marker and start outlining the inside of his head. Okay, so now that I have the blue all done, it's a little easier to explain. So if you can see that I have the inside on the left blue and then on the right I have it on the outside of his head blue that kind of gives it the effect of it's glitchy so once you're done with the blue you want to go in with the red and you want to do the opposite on each side so on the left side I want to do it on the outside of the head now once you finish the red outline you're gonna start putting in the lines so I'm gonna start with the red first After you're done with the red, grab your blue marker and do the same thing on the opposite side. Once you're done adding the glitch lines, what you want to do is grab a white Posca marker and then just kind of go over all the lines in different areas, kind of connect the two, make it look like you didn't draw there at all. And once you're done doing all of that, it should kind of make it look more glitched. Once you're done doing all of your white marks to give it that glitch effect, you want to re-go over all of your black lines with the black Posca marker just to freshen up your lines. Now that we're done going over our black lines one more time, this is, this is our end result. And if you like this video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and even a comment if you want me to do a different video. I have a TikTok and I do lots of different things like the split effect like this. I did a pixel. I also did the drip effect where it makes it look like it's melting. And just regular cartoon theme and as you know glitch. So if you guys like this video and you want to see other tutorials like the drip effect just comment below what you want to see. And thank you guys for watching.